This is David Hofmeister's Unwind Your Mind Back to God. Read by Tarana Singh. In today's episode, we continue laying the foundation with Book 1. In Chapter 6, this is Section 26. Opening to Divine Love. It always feels heartwarming to extend divine love, releasing the temptation to look outside for the source of love and instead extending the love within is the key to lasting happiness. For love is like a never-ending well spring bubbling up. The more we extend it, the more we are aware that we have it and are it. Love makes no distinctions and does not discriminate, for love bathes all in its kindly light. This is what makes love a gift to all. The world was made as a substitute for divine love. The world's love involves bargain, reciprocity, control, specialness and its core characteristic is possessiveness. While divine love radiates and shines without limitation, condition or restriction, possessive love is full of rules, boundaries, demands and expectations. Divine love is free and freely given. Possessive love is always looking for what it will get in return. Possessive love has many strings attached to its gift. Divine love knows not of strings or attachments, for it flows as powerfully, silently, joyfully, and freely as a grand river. We cannot direct the course of love. We can surrender into the current of divine love and it will carry us until we happily realize that the I am presence of divine love is our very self in God. The love of God is everlasting and thus everything else that seems to be will fade and disappear as we remember the everlasting light of divine love. Glory to God for creating divine love as one. 